Cause like I said, I always try to step on my box and then I don't know, just always regret it. Like I buy stuff and I'm like, who did you think you was? Where did you think he was going? Now this again is more of a like out your box. Why did you buy this? Where are you wearing this to? Who did you think you was type of thing? I don't know, she ain't got a lot of like nice stuff, but it's like stuff that's like going out and it's like, I don't go out. Y'all see, it's like fully see-through. It's like, where are you wearing that to? <laughs> Hey friends, it's Ivelisse J, I-V-E-L-I-S-S-E, -S -S -E, and I'm back with another freaking video. Now, before we do anything, before we go any further, before you start actually watching the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And while you at it, you can just go watch my other videos. As y'all can see from the title of this video, this video is actually gonna be a haul, a sheen haul. I haven't done one of these in so long, and every time I do a haul, I be so nervous. Like, I don't know, the sit down and talk videos always makes me more nervous than like doing a vlog or, but then it's crazy because I could come on YouTube looking crazy, like straight out of bed, like looking ridiculous and I'm more nervous to do a video like this. So I'm not even gonna make this a long intro at all, like at all, we're just gonna get right into this video. I bought all these clothes, as y'all can see on the rack or whatever. I bought all these for Black Friday. I got the receipt on my iPad, so I'm gonna be looking down to tell y'all prices, sizes and stuff like that. So I bought one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, about nine shirts, two bags, a like little vest, a pair of shoes, and i think that's about it but i bought all that for less than a hundred dollars which is amazing like even when it's not black friday i feel like she always got the best deals so yeah we're just gonna jump into this we're gonna start with accessories going to shirts then well really all i bought was shirts because i don't know y'all like i either wear sweatpants all the time or leggings all the time i rarely wear jeans but i have jeans but what i really don't have is like shirts so this is like a sheen essentials type of video so basically in this haul i bought a lot of t-shirts i bought a lot of like yeah just basically t-shirts for real like and like i said there's a few accessories but mainly i just wanted shirts like to throw on under a jacket so all these shirts y'all about to see is like shirts that i bought to wear under something so either under a jacket under a flannel under you know whatever it is a jean jacket a coat whatever but like i said i prefer crop tops because i'm very short so when i wear like regular size shirts it just fits me too long all the time so like i said these shirts is like i said just essential something that you need something that will make an outfit you could dress it up dress it down so we're just gonna get right into this so to start off i got this bag y'all know i'm extra i'll be putting stuff on hangers that don't even need to be on hangers so i bought this bag it was like a little tote bag i love bags like this and as y'all what is this as y'all see it just says youth all around i didn't really notice what it said on the bottom like when i first bought it so when i got it i was like that's kind of dumb it don't make sense like it don't make sense maybe i'm reading it wrong let me try it again someday to be able to say that it is not youth not loser we were born in 2001 like i'm saying i didn't see that if i would have seen it i'm pretty sure i still would have bought the bag but like I said, I just didn't see that part. What I like about this bag is that it's a tote bag, but it also has like the magnet closing. I don't know. I prefer tote bags, but sometimes it just be too out to open or whatever. It has like a little pocket, which is good for like my lip gloss, my taser, my pepper spray and stuff like that. Cause that's stuff you don't want just like loose in the bag. Sometimes tote bags don't come with that. So like I said, that's I feel like it's very important. Not much more to say about this bag. It's just really, really cute. But I'm gonna tell y'all the price that I paid for the bag and I'm gonna put like the price that it actually was, like without the Black Friday sale, without the coupon and stuff like that. I'm gonna put it up here. So I paid $5.94 for this bag, which I feel like is really good. I feel like tote bags, I don't know, they just, everybody needs them. Like you could just throw stuff and go. It's perfect for like a fit. It's perfect for like running errands. I actually prefer these more than like crossbody or like, you know, actual purses because I'm this type of person. Like I'm just throw it in the bag, let's go. So yeah, this is the first item and we just gonna move on. So this next bag was actually on my Christmas list. Like I just wanted a bag with this type of look to it. I seen it in Walmart when I was passing one time and I didn't really have time to stop and like actually go. I seen it from like a distance. So this is like a little puff bomber bag type of thing. Like it's just so cute. I just, I don't know why. It just caught my eye when I was in Walmart. Like this also has like the little magnet closing which i feel like all bags should have because you don't want just anybody like just looking in your bag and stuff like that so yeah this is what it looks like it's not as puffy as it looks it's actually very thin compared to how it looks on the screen like it looks like it's just like a coat but it's not this bag seems like it's gonna be very durable like i don't know just the straps is like thicker than my other bags usually when i buy bags off sheen i really like them because like the look but sometimes they don't last like i'm gonna show y'all one of my bags that i bought probably like a couple 
I don't know, a couple hauls ago. Let me show you. So I don't know if y'all remember this haul, but I actually bought this bag. And this was my favorite bag. Like, it's still my favorite bag. Even though it's broken multiple times, I still wear this bag. So it came with like a longer like crossbody strap. But the piece that it was supposed to be clipped on broke. So I'm like, you know what? It's okay. So I decided to try to like clip it on the zipper. Like, you know, just like clip it on. But that broke. So I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to wear like a little tote bag. But this is my favorite bag. Like I used to have like a fake water bottle in here. Like there was never water in there. It was just like for the look. But this was, like I said, one of my favorite bags. I tried to buy it again, but it wasn't in stock. But like I said, I think this is going to be like my favorite like everyday bag because it's just so cute. Like so I paid $11.87 for the bag, but originally the bag was $14 or something like that. Like I said, I'm gonna put it on the screen. But yeah, so this is, like I said, one of my favorite. Well, I actually like this whole haul, but this favorite bag like. So the next items, don't ask me why they are hangers. I just feel like when I'm doing a haul, everything goes on a hanger. Like even when I buy socks, I try to hang them up. It's like a two pack of these like matte butterfly clips. I'm gonna bring them closer so y'all can see. It's like this like gray white bone off white color and then this black color i've been into wearing my hair clipped up a lot i'm gonna put a picture so y'all can see what i'm talking about but i just feel like i needed these because it's hard to find like a good one that doesn't break that holds all your hair so i just i don't know i just wanted to try it but this like it feels like it has a crazy grip like it's like even kind of hard to open so i know that it's gonna hold all my hair up i don't know if it's gonna be big enough but like i said i just bought them to try them so i bought these clips for 127 like i said it's a two pack originally it was 150 so now we're gonna move into the actual clothes so i ended up buying this multi-pack deal type of item whatever that it just comes with three shirts like you can never go wrong with like solid I don't know just the basics like you know what i'm saying you could like i said dress them up dress them down i just feel like they're perfect and you could wear them in the summer in the winter like i said like i just feel like stuff like this is so perfect stuff like this is so me i don't really like stuff with too much graphic i don't really like stuff with too much i don't know they just do too much i feel like with my other sheen hauls i always try to buy stuff just to try it out like i'm like you know let me step away from like the basics the blacks and and i end up not really liking the clothes like it's cool but i end up not wearing them so i try to go for more my style this like this haul because like i said i always try to step on my box and then i don't know just always regret it so yeah i bought these like little crop top rib t-shirts so it came with a black a gray oh a gray and then it also came with this white one but i wore it yesterday so i'm gonna just show you how the white one looks like I said, I just put it on with like an army fatigue, like jacket with some light jeans and some shoes. Like I said, I just feel like stuff like this is needed. Like just when you want to throw on a fit, just when you want to, I don't know, do whatever you want with them. So originally these three shirts, like I said, the white, the black and the gray, it was $15, but I bought it for $12.72. All of these shirts, I bought them, well, not all of them. Like obviously you just choose one size, but I bought them in a large. When it comes to sheen, I kind of buy my shirts like a mix. Like I buy some large, some medium, some extra large because I don't know how nothing's gonna fit me. So like I said, I just want something to fit me. So I don't buy them all the same size. I try to like mix it up cause I'm like, one of them is bound to fit me. So the next few items was like, a combo type of thing too so i bought kind of like the same thing but kind of not it's like these like little crop t-shirts so i bought these three colors i bought like an olive green like a i thought it was gonna be like an off-white or like a like a bone color but in person it looks like like a soft banana color like it's like a soft yellow i don't know like i said in the picture it looked more of like a beige or like a i don't know this is not the color i thought it was gonna be but it's okay and then y'all know obviously we love regular black shirts so i ended up buying a black one i bought all of these in a size large as well and originally these shirts were 17 dollars, but i paid 11 dollars and 66 cents the colors are just like i said i really thought this one was gonna be beige but the colors would have been perfect if that one was beige i like buying little shirts like that because like i'm saying like i feel like you get a good deal because it's like three shirts for ten dollars or eleven dollars like that's perfect now this one i'm not even lie. this one was like a let's try something new, let's get out our box type of shirt. And I bought it because it's been in my shopping cart. It's like this piece sticking up, but it's been in my shopping cart for like a couple weeks or a couple months or something. And I never bought it cause I'm like, what am I gonna wear that to? Where am I gonna go with that? And a lot of times when I shop on Sheen, that always happens. Like I buy stuff and I'm like, who did you think you was? Where did you think you was going? Cause like, I don't know, Sheen got a lot of like nice stuff, but it's like stuff that's like going out and it's like, I don't go out so it's like why did you buy that but it's this like mesh 
little collar shirt, dress up shirt type of thing. Y'all see, it's like fully see-through. It's like, where are you wearing it too? But I just thought it was so cute. Like I just thought it was so cute to wear, I don't know where, but I'm gonna wear it. Even if I don't wear it out, I'm still gonna take a picture with it. So this shirt was originally $6 and I paid $5.06. I just like the like detail in the shirt. Like y'all see it's like the like unfinished, like, you know, thread sticking out. I don't know, I like that in shirts. Like, I just think it's so cute. I bought this in a size large as well. I tried this on already, but personally, I feel like I would have wanted it to be like more of a looser fit, like more of a like, like not sluggish, but like, you know, like a looser, like I could have threw this on with like, pair of like boyfriend jeans or something like that but it's kind of like tight so mm -hmm. and large was the biggest size I could have got it so like I said like I just wish it would have been a little bit more bigger a little bit more looser I kind of like had an outfit idea for this but like I said once I tried it on I was like mm, this don't look how I thought it was gonna look so like I said it's still cute I'm probably gonna have to cut the tag off I didn't really see the tag but yeah now this again is more of a like out your box why did you buy this where are you wearing this to? Who did you think you was type of thing? But I got it. So I seen like a lot of like outfits created with this, like on Instagram, on like TikTok, on like, you know, like social media in general. And I just thought it was like really, really cute. I was like kind of hesitant to buy it, but I don't know. You know, like when you have something in your head for so long and it's just like, you gotta buy it because you've been thinking about it for too long. So this is kind of what it is. There's no real purpose of it. It's just, I don't know, to add on to an outfit, to make an outfit a little more like, mm. This originally was $19. I would have not originally paid $19 for this. So I think that's why I never got it. But I paid like 15 and it don't sound like a big difference cause it's like, it's $4. But if you think about it, $19 is almost $20. I would have not paid $20 for this. But 15, that's like, mm, I could pay 15. So I bought this in a size medium. I was kind of going to get the large, but then I'm like, I'm really short. So I feel like the large would have been longer. This is like perfect. Like I don't at all regret getting a medium because it stops like exactly at my waist. So it just looked cute. I feel like the large would have like looked like a work vest type of thing. And that's not the look I was going for. This fits me with a hoodie under, which is perfect because in my head, the outfit that I had was like a hoodie with this. I don't know. Y'all going to see whatever outfit I decide to put together. But like I said, this was just so cute. I don't know why, but I needed it in my closet. So I bought it. But yeah, so the next item, I purchased it by itself. Like it wasn't in like a set or anything like that, but I just really like the color. So it's basically the same thing that y'all seen the past like six shirts, but it's in brown. So I bought this in a size large on its own, like I said, and originally it was $5. I ended up spending like $4.30 for it. I just felt like it was perfect. It's not ripped. It's like simple, like, you know, like I said, just to throw on under something. So the next thing I bought, like I said, it was like my favorite thing. Like soon as I opened it, I was in love. Soon as I opened it i was like i already know this is gonna be a good haul so i used to have these like black heels that i wore for like every family occasion every time i got dressed up or whatever i used to wear those heels they ended up breaking on halloween like i was dressed up as like a lego for halloween and i had a lego but i had on like the heels or whatever it ended up like breaking it ended up like snapping because i was playing so i ended up finding these and i just feel like these are so perfect like these are like i said one of my favorite things i've ever bought of sheen it's just like these like sock heels type things i know y'all seen them but like i said i decided to buy them off sheen and i love the heel like if you look at it from the side it just looked like a skinny heel but it's not it's like a like a flat heel like it's not a chunky heel it's just like a flat heel like which I like because chunky heels sometimes, I don't know, sometimes they look childish to me, but then like skinny ones like this, I can't really walk in. Y'all yeah, know like that fish off SpongeBob that, you know, like he was in school with or whatever that he was like real skinny from the side and then like got like wide from, this is exactly what this heel was given, but it's just so cute. Like it's so comfortable. You just slip it right on. It feel like a sock, but I bought these in a size seven and a half and they just fit so perfect. Originally these boots was $27, but I ended up paying like 23 or 22 or something like that. They fit perfect. Like they're comfortable to walk in and they're just so cute. I almost hit myself in my face, but it's okay. So yeah, that's about it for this haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you want to see more videos like this or whatever I have coming up on my channel, make sure you subscribe and turn on that post notification so you know every time I post.